Hey, what's up you guys? It's Nikki and I am back again with another video for you today. The seasons have changed once again and obviously that means for me that I went shopping more than one time. So I have a collective haul to show you for this upcoming winter. I'm calling it a part one because I'm assuming that um, around December, January, I'll probably do a huge other shopping spree again and then I'll have more to show you. So for now, this is going to be called um, my winter haul part one. But there is a lot to show so I'm just going to get right into it. I'm going to start right off the bat with showing you my two most wintry items that I picked up, which I'm like super excited about and I hope I get to wear them as much as I think in my head that I will. And if not, I'm just going to be really sad. But I picked up two pairs of um, like holiday Christmas leggings from Marshalls. Um, they're both like, I don't even know, I guess it's like a fleecy cotton type feel. But this pair is got a little, it's got little reindeers on it and some snowflakes and they're like maroon and black and white, which are like my favorite colors. So these ones are super adorable, and I was worried that they would be see-through because there's a lot of white on them, but they're not. And then I got a darker pair, um, which is by the same brand, which is called See You Monday from Los Angeles. But these pair are a lot darker, and they've got more like of a black and gray and maroon instead of the white. And I'm really excited about both of them. So I do a ton of online shopping, especially on Urban Outfitters, because I love um, most of Urban Outfitters selections that they have. Um, and those are the ones that they have on their website and not in their store because I think they sell a lot of really cool brands And my favorite one of my favorite companies is Adidas and I've had my eye on this sweatshirt for literally ever and um, Recently my mom bought it for me, which was like super awesome And it's this Adidas Berlin sweatshirt that I believe you can only get online I don't even know if Adidas actually sells it on their website either But um, it looks like this and it's got the trefoil on the breast pocket Well not pocket but like the breast area and then it's got three stripes down the bottom on this sleeve, it has one stripe, which is the left sleeves, sleeve, and then on the right sleeve, it has three, ooh, three stripes. But the sweatshirt's sweet. It's so cool. It's huge on me, and it's medium, and it's cotton, and it's really warm, and I've worn it probably way too many times since I've gotten it, like, about a week ago, but about a week ago. <laughs> but I love it. Next up, I pick up, picked up two new pairs of jeans because I love jeans. Um, I wear leggings a ton too, but I love wearing jeans. And when I can find like a good pair of comfortable jeans that I know I can wear a ton, I like can't resist. So the first pair I got is from Bullhead, which sells um, at PacSun. It's probably the most common place to find it. Um, and I love Bullhead jeans. They're a little pricier, but when they're like something that you just have to have, it's like, all right, it's worth it because they're such good quality. So these are Bullhead jeans and they're a boyfriend style. So they're kind of like worn in right now because I just wore them, but it's got the two holes in the knees and then it comes up like right at the ankle and then they're rolled. Um, I literally love these. Like they're so, they're low rise and they're so comfortable and I've just been wearing them a ton with like t-shirts and sweaters. Then the other pair is a pair that I just bought yesterday, so I haven't gotten to wear them yet, but I'm really excited about them. Um, they're Hollister bootcut jeans that I got for $25. I don't know why they were on sale. But they're light wash, and then they've got like tiny baby rips in them, like you can literally barely see them. And then they're boot cut on the bottom. But these are also really nice because they're super stretchy, like they're more jeggingy, jeggingy I guess, than um, the bullhead ones, which is fine because the bullhead ones are boyfriend, so they don't need to be stretchy. But I love the elastic in these. The only problem was that I had to buy a short instead of regular for like the first time ever, and I don't know why. I guess because it's boot cut and not um, skinny jeans, but I literally tried on the regulars and then I was like, wow, I love these. Too bad they're literally going to like my toes. So I had to, I had to buy the short ones and that was a huge bummer for me. I was really disappointed. So then also from Abercrombie, um, I bought this long sleeve, kind of like not so much turtleneck, but like a mock turtleneck kind of thing. Um, it goes only to like here, it doesn't all come all the way up to my chin so that I like look like I don't have a neck. But it's really classy and I really like it. It's just like a cotton shirt. And then it's um, flowy, it's not like tight everywhere, but the sleeves are tight. And they had it in like a ton of different colors. This is like the like charcoal -y slate gray. But they had it in like navy and like some striped colors and I think like maroon. But I really liked this because I thought it was like a classier thing. Like it's good to wear for like when I have a presentation at school or I feel like it's really cold, it'll go good with um, jackets over it. But um, I'm, I've already worn it to work and then I wore it out to breakfast and I really liked the way it looked on me. It's, it's just a nice shirt and it's really, really soft and comfortable. So Next up, I probably got too many things from Calvin Klein, um, but I'm really excited about everything I picked up and I'm like super into their athletic clothing, so this is just going to be good. Like, I don't even care. The first thing that I got was um, these like, I don't even know how to explain them. They're not midi, but they're not full length. They go to like almost my ankle, 
but like also almost my knee. They're like right in the middle. I guess they're not full length, but they're kind of, I'm short, so they like almost are. And <laughs> they're royal blue and with like black detailing on them. They're just um, athletic pants. So they're like super stretchy, but they're caught in. And they're really, really cute. I like them a lot. They had them in a different color, a couple different colors, but I liked the blue. So then drew me to those ones. Um, I also got my first Calvin Klein sports bra, which I super love. Wait, I want to make sure you can like really see it. So it's black, um, almost like a neoprene kind of feel. I doubt it is, but if literally it's, I guess it's like a dry fit kind of material. Like I feel like if it got wet, it would just bead right off. Um, and then it has like white detailing around it. And then the back has like this mesh pocket in the middle and it's got obviously the super infamous Calvin Klein band across the bottom of it. And I love it. Um, there's no pads in it, but I don't plan on like running a couple miles in this thing. Like I just really like the look of it. It's really flattering sports bra. And then of course, because it's me, I had to buy not one, but two pairs of the same exact Calvin Klein sweatpants because I just love them so much. The first pair I bought was these ones. Um, and I had to go back and get another one, but these are just great Calvin Klein sweatpants. They have um, elastic cinch bottoms, and then in very faint letters, you can literally barely see it, it says Calvin Klein like down the thigh. Um, but what sold me, like I literally love, it has this uh, the, like cotton band at the top, but you can fold it down for like a spandex band that says Calvin Klein, so it almost looks like um, you like rolled your sweatpants and have like Calvin Klein underwear on under them. So it just says Calvin Klein performance. Um, on, across the band and they do have um, ties so that you can tighten them. So I bought these pair, or this pair, and I literally was like I love you so much and like a couple days later went back and bought the same ones but in black, you can see the Calvin Klein a little better, with the blue elastic band that also says Calvin Klein performance. So I literally love these. I think they're so awesome. Cinch on the bottom. I've worn them so many times. They're just like perfect for everything. Like I have Adidas Superstars and they look so cute. Also like my Nike Roshis look so good with them. They're just like the kind of sweatpants that are like super fashionable but they're also like unbelievably comfortable. I mean the entire inside is fleece. Like I literally love them. I love them. I don't know what else to tell you. I love them. From Victoria's Secret, I actually did good. Um, I didn't buy that much. I only bought two things. Uh, but I literally love both of them. Like I did really good in this haul. I'm like obsessed with everything I bought. <laughs> So this is a shirt that I, again, have worn way too many times since I bought it. My favorite color is burgundy. It's a burgundy long sleeve, like, cotton t-shirt. It says pink on the breast pocket, and then it says pink in cursive letters down the right sleeve, and nothing on the back. But I, this, like, it's just such a good thing to have. I wear it with leggings. I wear it with jeans. Like, I sleep in it. It's just a great, great shirt that I love. Um, I don't remember how much it costs. I think it was probably like 30 bucks, which is like pricey for a t-shirt, but I've worn it so many times at this point that I'm like, mm, it's okay, I would buy it again. And then I got their just basic um, cotton uh, yoga pants. These are like the boot cut ones, just because I needed some new ones. Um, they're a charcoal gray band, and then this is the front. It says VS on the front, because I am I prefer the ones. Like, I don't really like the ones that say a ton of stuff on the back, like the angel and all that. I don't mind them, but for me, like, sequins aren't my style and stuff, so I love these ones, because I like that this is, like, a more sporty look. Um, which I'm pretty sure, like, most of the time that I'm wearing this, my shirt's long enough that this gets covered anyway, so I don't really care. But these are just, like, probably the best um, yoga pants in the world. So I have two more clothing items to show you before I get into my like few accessories that I've gotten and I don't even know how to explain like how much that I like absolutely adore these two things. They're from the same company which is um, the brand Thread and Supply and I, I honestly just have to show you because I can't even explain. I got two jackets from this company. Um, the first one <laughs> looks like this. It's this beautiful cargo jacket. Um, it's like green cargo khaki I guess and then it's got all these beautiful um, buckles and pockets and then a cinch around the waist and it goes I want to say like mid thigh probably not even like just down past your butt um and it has this awesome hood but the best part like look at these beautiful sleeves this is such thick knit this jacket is so warm and these colors are literally so amazing like I am obsessed with this jacket I love it I wish I could wear it every day but it's just like not something that I don't know I feel like me it's it's too colorful to be like my everyday jacket but like I really it the times that I have worn it, I've gotten so many compliments on it, and I love it. And then the other jacket I got from Thread and Supply is also something that I literally adore. It's this brown leather jacket, or pleather jacket, it's not real. But, um, it has, like, the folds so that it zippers up and it looks so good. And then it's got these just cool zippers all over the place. One on the sleeve, 
I don't actually know if that even opens. And I like can't find out because of the way I'm holding it. I don't think it does. But then pockets right here on both sleeve, um, both like sides of the jacket. And it's just this leather coat. It actually had like little buckles right here so that it like cinched um, around your waist. But I cut them off because I didn't like that part as much, but you really can't tell like either way, it was fine. Um, this jacket is also super warm and it's just beautiful because I love leather. And I'm like, obsessed with that company. I need to look them up online. I bought those at Marshalls, but the company Thread and Supply, I should really look them up and like, see what else they have because they know how to make a good jacket. Okay, so for the last part of the video, I have my accessories, which is like two little accessories that I got from Aerie and then um, two pairs of shoes. So the accessories that I picked up from Aerie are um, a little pair of gloves and a hat. So I have like rings on, so this is going to be hard to show you. But um, I got little fingerless gloves that look like this. They're cream and then um, they've got like a little thumb pocket and then like ones for my hand. And I literally love these so much. They have them, I saw them at least, in um, cream and navy, but knowing Ari, they probably have them in like black and gray and like all the neutral colors that they sell as well. Um, but these are literally so awesome. They're actually pretty warm, and but like above all, they make texting and like using your phone or eating or anything like so easy because of the fact that they're fingerless. And I just think they're like super adorable, like they're like fashionable. It's not like I'm wearing like these like big ugly fake gloves, or not fake, but big ugly gloves to like keep my hands warm. Um, and then the other thing I got with those is probably like the greatest hat of all time. It looks like this and it's got that salt and pepper look with like a huge bubble at the, um, at the top. And then it's just like literally like this big sack that you can fold to be as big as you want or you can wear it just like this. But I like that they made it so adjustable so that like fits everybody's head exactly how they want it to. Um, and this again, again is like super warm. I love hats and I've worn this a couple times since I bought it. And again, people just like really think it's adorable. Like I think it looks good on everybody. All my friends have tried it on. It's one of those colors and like styles that just like is like so adorable. Like you put it on, you're like, oh, I love it. And so finally I get to show you guys my shoes that I've picked up so far this winter. I mean, I'm a shoe person. I literally like always buy new shoes but um so far i've gotten two pairs the first are these um they're like ugg or fake ugg fugs um these are the brand bear paw which is also like a great great brand and these were so much cheaper than i think this style of ugg is like 160 dollars and i paid 35 for these which i bought them at marshall's so bear paw is still kind of expensive these are probably like 75 dollars shoes i would assume i think that sounds about right because um, Bear, Bear Paw uses real sheepskin as well. Um, but yeah, like I said, like I got these for $35 and I was like, yeah, like I I'm, would so rather do that than pay the $160 just because they're UGG. So they're just like your basic like white girl shoes. They're like low and they've got the little clip on them. But they're just good to wear with like leggings and stuff and when I'm slipping over my friend's houses. And then the last pair um, of shoes that I got, like honestly deserve a moment of silence because these are the most beautiful boots I've ever seen in my life. They're green, olive green Timberland boots. Um, I have a pair of Timberland. I have brown, dark brown leather ones that are kind of like this. Like, they're like a more feminine work boot. But um, these ones are absolutely gorgeous. They've got a black uh, leather band up here, and then they've got the like the sweet Timberland style laces that are honestly like maroon and mustard color. But this just like this olive green is it's so unique, and I love it. It's suede. Um, and I like how low they are. They're honestly, I don't, I don't even know how to explain them. Like, they're just beautiful. I like that they're super wide because they just make, like, your legs look really, like, dainty and feminine because the boots are, like, almost like duck feet, you know? Um, they're super cute. I love them. I've gotten so many compliments again. And I, they're, since they're big, I can, like, stuff wicked thick socks into them. And I've been getting some good use out of those shoes. They're going to last me, like, ages, too. So I absolutely love those. So that is all for my first part of my winter haul. Like I said, I'm pretty sure there will probably be another one coming up within like a month or two. After like the holiday seasons, like I just know that there's going to be more and I'm going to want to show you guys. So stay tuned because that will probably be coming eventually. But this is the end of my first part. Um, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Leave any comments if you have questions about where I bought things or like sizes or anything. I'll, I'm sure that I'll be able to help you out and can let you know. Um, so thank you for watching and I will see you all again soon. Bye! Oh,